Good morning. <laughs> so today is the shoot to the hole event. It is the um, Mayel Hair Care South by Southwest Hue Tour event um, today. What am I going to do with this hair, y'all? What am I going to do? So um, I did buy two box colors. I have one that is like a golden type of color and then another one that is more of a chocolate color. My hair right now, my roots are um, giving me more like brown chocolatey vibes and then my tips are like a honey blonde that i dyed months ago maybe even a year ago um so i really want to update it i feel like it's like i don't know dead not literally my hair dead but the color in which i have it is not what i want right now so um the event starts at 12 um but like they have these goodie bags if you get there on time or you know early it's like the first 500 people get a goodie bag and i really want one because when i went to the event last year i missed out because i underestimated austin's turnout <laughs> yeah i'm really excited but it is now just turned eight o'clock basically so i only have a few hours to get ready so that me and my sister can get there about 10 30. um so i was thinking about just going ahead and dyeing my hair right now like giving my hair about 45 minutes of time and then i can focus on like my makeup and stuff like that um but yeah so i think i'm gonna do that so 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 Hopefully we made it before 500 people, but we'll see. I do want to share something with you guys that I've never shared before. Um, I shared on 
um, certain things that I do, but I always ask, even before I go speak, I always ask God to just give me the wisdom and to give me the knowledge to just, and give me the words to speak to really touch people. And whatever you feel that, you know, you, whatever it is that you may feel that somebody in the audience wants to hear, like just give me those words to speak. So um, four years ago, I actually was pregnant with my third child. I was pregnant with my, my son and it was a very high risk pregnancy. And if you guys notice, I'm like breathing fast now because it's a very um, emotional topic for me. So I, <laughs> I was doing good and I was, I was blowing, um, but it's a very emotional topic for me. Um, however, if you guys notice, I have two children. So you say, okay, where's my son? He didn't make it. Um, mm -hmm. I was pregnant for eight and a half months. I gave birth and unfortunately my son was not, he didn't make it through the pregnancy. He, I had a uterine rupture. Um, he was brain damaged and he passed away, so. It's okay. So anyway, it was on my heart to share that because I want you guys to know that, you know, it took for something very devastating and very traumatic to happen in my life for me to understand that I had a bigger purpose. And when you don't follow your purpose and you don't follow what God is calling you to do, mm -hmm. he will make a way for you to wake up and to understand mm -hmm. that, you know, there's something bigger in this life. So when that <laughs> happened, when that happened to me, um, and if you know, four years ago, Mayel was created, that Mayel was birthed out of pain. And that's what a lot of people don't know. Like you see the story, you see my glory, you see everything that I'm doing on Instagram, it looks glamorous, but just know that my L didn't get here without me going through a very traumatic time in my life and going through that pain. Um, and in order to keep my mind sane, I did a lot of prayer, I did a lot of soul searching and asking God for that direction. And this, and that's when the spirit spoke to me and said, you know, this is what you're supposed to be doing. Like you're here to inspire others and you know, I create products, I create great products. However, I want you guys to know that it's bigger than the products. I'm not here because of my nail hair products. I'm here because I feel that my gift is to inspire others because there are so many of you that are probably sitting here now just wondering, I have this dream that's in me, but I don't know what to do. I don't know how to you know, get to my get to my dream. Just know that if I did it, you can do it too. And I'm no different than you. I didn't come from a rich family. I didn't come from a, 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 I wasn't born with a silver spoon in my mouth. I didn't come from a land of entrepreneurs. So all of this is just foreign to me. And I'm still on this journey and I'm still learning every single day how to be a better businesswoman, how to be a better CEO. Um, but just know that my hill, you know, it, it's, it's a gift from God and that's what, you know, I truly believe that this is my gift, this is my purpose, um, and this is a this is anointed by God. So when you guys use the products, just know that it's an anointing in those products. <laughs> Team of black women, black girl magic. <laughs> give opportunity to women that look like me. Like, I pride myself in that. And I love having a team of women that look like me. Like, we have fun in the office because sometimes it can't just always be about work and business. Like, I think I'm a cool person. I'm a leaper. You know, I'm pretty down. <laughs> <laughs> um, and I like to have fun. I'm not always serious because you can't take life so serious. Life is too short. Um, and just live a little bit, laugh a little bit, and just have fun. So I'll see you guys at our booth. Thank you, guys. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Guys, just got back from the event. I'm at my sister's crib now. Um, maybe I'll look this way. <sighs> the event was great. Um, very empowering. Um, I'm going to definitely insert some clips of, or you probably would have already seen, some clips of Mayel, the CEO of the Mayel. Her name is Mo, and she was awesome. She was very inspirational, and she was talking about like her reasoning for starting her own company and all that stuff, which really aligned with what's going on with me. Um, so I just thought like, she was speaking to me. Girl, it was empowering definitely kind of sparked some creative juices some motivation and just kind of really need to get the ball rolling when it comes to our g mode and stuff actually got this huge oh my gosh huge bag full of stuff 
So there is really no excuse for my hair to not look cute at all times now. <laughs> I'll be doing a haul with all the stuff that I've either purchased and also the goodie bag that they gave us for the first 500 people to come to the event. So happy that I was on time to get a swag bag. Um, but yeah, that is it. Um, the rest of the night, we're actually going to do a girls' night. So I may show you guys some of that. If not, this may be the end of this vlog. Thank you guys for watching. Um, yeah, just I appreciate you 